Hello guys and welcome back to Star Drive with the Black Box and Combined Arms mods where um, peace reigns in the galaxy at the moment and um, we're just sort of uh, trying to build up in particular our fourth fleet with these new cruisers and I'm researching technologies, uh, velocity package at the moment. Oh, hello. <laughs> okay, commentator's curse. Um, <laughs> peace does not reign in the galaxy. Uh, all right, well, okay. Let me just pause for a second. I was talking about uh, attacking the Vulfa anyway. So that's just brought that forward, I suppose. Um, let's move the first fleet to uh, Rennie and uh, scout that out. I will... Let's bring the 4th fleet in readiness, actually, and the 6th, and um, grab some troops. Uh, ideally, yeah, from Simra would be good. Let's, uh, let's launch those. I will queue up a couple more tanks here. Let's just uh, let the game advance so I can grab my troops. And we'll send them in that direction. So, third fleet. Where is the third fleet? Yes, good. It's at uh, Ridnia, which is where I hoped it would be. Um, third fleet, you may as well uh, take out this subspace projector. Let's not make life easy for them. So, um, okay, try on is quite exposed. I did improve the defences there. Um, we've got a shield generator. Currently only 21. You know, it's just been built, so it's uh, building up uh, its charge. Um, do I need to change anything else? Not for the moment. I think, um, you know, we, we were getting prepared anyway. So we'll just press the button on that sort of stuff. So first fleet is here. So they've got some defences. Oh, okay, that's quite an interesting layout. Uh, what about the world itself? Okay, some grunts, not much yet. This should be this should be fine. So we'll just uh, allow the fourth fleet to get into position, and the sixth fleet. Not that we'll need to bombard it much, but uh, we'll hit uh, Renai. Already, and then yeah, maybe Amunix, Stren, Strengag. <laughs> um, but I was I was talking about attacking these as well. But okay, we're at war now, so we'll just go for we'll go for as many as we can. Third fleet, I will keep at Ridnia because it's not very strong. Um, it's kind of made up of a lot of our other ships. What have we got? We've still got quite a lot of these plasma. Stones. So if I go there, plasma stone, Mark One. Let's um, let's upgrade all of you then to the Mark Fours, and I'll add a load of Mark Fours into um, yes, yeah, so upgrade to the Mark Four. I'll add that thing as a war. I've got locked on to um, the view there. Um, as we're at war, I'll, I'll press these little frigates into service in the in the third fleet. So fourth has arrived. Let's um, the number of gravity wells. Uh, if we come over here, we should avoid them. Yeah, like that. Stick them behind. Oh, let's bring the fifth fleet as well. And uh, yeah, we'll obviously bring the troops in. So if we were going to have a war, this is the war I would probably want at this point. Um, better even than um, being able to backstab the Dauntless for now. So we're launching our drones. And indeed the cruisers are moving up as well. With their uh, yeah, 60,000 shields. What are the drones? The drones are the little bee stings. The cruisers are hanging back. I'm not 
sure why that is. I would have thought they'd have wanted to get into um, into torpedo range. Long range weapons, yeah, okay. Well, the drones are uh, doing what they need to do, so Sixth Fleet, let's get in and bombard. Slowly grinding down the station. And we'll grab those troops as well, just jump them in a bit closer. Are we actually going to be able to destroy the station with drones? God, there's a furious uh, barrage. Um, might be that our bombers can do. Ooh, I'll tell you what, six feet actually pull away because uh, it's not going to take much to. There we go. Gosh, that. Um, not that you can hear the bombs landing over the. Um, over the. furious. drones. Um, let's grab the troops and get them involved. Still hitting these um, stations, though. Um, hmm. Do the stations have any guns left? So I've got a few. There we go. So we need to get a bit closer, and then the plasma torpedoes are uh, hitting the targets, and uh, we'll make short work of it. There we go. So that invasion should be successful. Let's move the first fleet up to... Um, what's there? Amunix? 5.2? Strenag? 6.2? Okay, yeah. Let's, let's move in this direction. So first fleet, come over here. Fourth, uh, sixth, and uh, yeah, I'll bring the fifth as well. We'll need more troops. Um, what about Tor? Yeah, that's more like it. So let's launch seven, and I'll queue up some tanks as well. Oopsie daisy, I didn't mean to click that. So let's grab all of these troops and send them to Aminix. Oh, Tryon, yeah, that's where the Volta have arrived. Um, in overwhelming numbers, yeah, that is that is a lot. That is a lot. Uh, 158 ships, okay, gosh. Using these shotguns. And missiles, or torpedoes, torpedoes. So we captured Renai. Uh, oh, got awful richness. Fertility's not great either. Not bad for an ice world, but um, no, we'll go research there. And um, yeah, I think that might be too many ships for me to take on right now. So we'll continue. We'll, we'll sort of mind our own business and launch our own offensive, whilst hopefully we build up the fourth fleet. Um, even further, so let's um, let's kind of fill out the gaps in the ranks now. Quite the big building program, but uh, not not as big as uh, the AI's fleet. So try on then. Um, yeah, all the space defenses have been taken out. I assume. These are, oh yeah, they're tanks. So they're landing their tanks. We don't have any defense batteries. Okay, so we're going to lose that this planet. Uh, gosh, if it's not wiped out in those big bombing salvos. Yeah, okay, they captured it. Okay, so one world apiece for the moment. And Ridnia, ooh. If they're going to attack, uh, hmm. I don't want to lose Ridnia. I'll bring the fourth fleet over. Lava pools of the defied. Uh, it was going to be attacked. Now it's not. 
Um, what I'll do, I'll hedge my bets. I'll bring the four fleet here, so it's kind of equidistant between the potential offensive and defensive. You know, I think if I'm going to defeat their fleet, it'll be with the fourth and the third combined, plus the planet's defenses, plus the you know the space stations. Maybe that will be enough. Uh, spies doing uh, spy things. So what are we faced with here? So Aminix six is not occupied. Three. So it's number one. And what about the second world? Yeah, so two and one. Um, okay, lots of ground forces, uh, some shields. Yeah, and okay, some orbital defenses here. So I will need the fourth fleet. Um, yeah, let's uh, let's go with that then. And. Uh, We'll bring the 6th over here, actually, 5th as well. The troops can come over there. How are things looking at Rydnia? You know, we've got quite a few orbital defences. Uh, yeah, I won't try and queue up anymore because they're... Um, they're contributing to building my uh, cruisers. Okay, so I think we've got caught here on a, on a gravity well, unfortunately. So that's going to slow our fourth feet down. My mistake, I should have let them go on a little bit further. First fleet then, why don't we... Why don't we send the first fleet to try and just to see whether they're Still hanging around there, or whether they are going to make uh, aggressive moves. There's a little Vulfa symbol there, which I assume is they're going to build a subspace projector and, you know, pave the way to their next attack, I assume. Ridnia 5, what are you up to? Oh, nothing at the moment. Let's get a gun emplacement. It's an agricultural world. Yeah, okay, so... I won't, uh, I won't interfere any more than that. No, oh, it looked like there were ships there. Okay, we've got past the gravity well, so the fourth fleet is now moving towards Aminix. Aminix. Uh, but we are getting a warning about being attacked. That warning did go last time, though, and it's mm, messed up my plans a bit. Oh, here they come. Here they come. What kind of force? They'll need more than that. Okay, Velocity Package 3 unlocked. That's good. Um... Base is getting stronger. Vulfa, yeah. And now I'm researching... Oh yeah, large freighters. Great. Oh, here comes the rest of them. Um, I don't want to lose Rydnia. So we'll bring the fourth... Ooh, we'll... Yeah, the third fleet's going to just... Hmm. No, come away, third fleet. Fourth, in like that. We'll um, hold off our offensive, so 5th, 6th, come back. Let's grab those troops and just move them a bit further out. And see whether we can uh, defend. Lots of uh, corvettes coming in. We are destroying quite a number of them with the, the firepower of the station, though they are now in shotgun range and the station shield is, is collapsing. Ooh, they've got the Vulfa Grunts coming in. Um, can I melt those before they uh, land? Mm, not in time.
should be able to take them down, surely. Okay, the station now is falling. Oh, damn. Where are they off to? Okay, on to Ridnia 5. Let's see. Well, they're kind of getting strung out a bit. Um, ship's boarded. Oh, right, because they took the planet. They um, captured all the stations and things above it. That is, uh, that is a shame. Their fleet is getting strung out a little bit. So, I will grab all of those forces and bring them over here because we're going to need to counterattack. This station doing, uh, doing some damage. Loads of fighters. Fourth fleet has almost arrived. holding out but ultimately not enough to uh, stifle the offensive on its own. Okay, so fourth fleet, where do we jump in? Where do we, let's jump in over here. Fourth and third. Because this seems to be their main body so perhaps we, if we try and attack over here we might be able to take out some of these carriers. It's tense. Okay, we've got large freighters. What was I researching next? Oh yeah, nano storage. Great. Uh, don't want to stop things to design the large freighters at the moment. So, full fleet. Let's uh, let's get into the action. Loads of drones being launched. Torpedoes also are now being fired by the cruisers. More torpedoes. Oh, Ridnia 1 has fallen. Damn. Yeah, I thought it was... Oh, yeah, Ridnia 1, yeah. Okay. Using these uh, cruisers one by one. With the main body of their fleet still intact. Those torpedo ships, 37,000 shields, you know. They're they're good, but they're not that good. Oh, and they're, yeah, they're main body now, coming to coming to engage us. We should get some supply from the planet. That may help. Torpedoes going in. Um, PD trying to shoot these uh, torpedoes down. That's good, yeah. As in their torpedoes, my plasma torpedoes also being shot. The cruiser's kind of uh, skirmishing a bit, which is good. That's what I wanted them to do. Oh, these guys are out on their own. I don't like that. These... Ships are a little bit, uh, a little bit far out, guys. Come and get involved a bit in the in the fight a bit closer, please. That's it. Then you can unleash your torpedoes, and you know we've caught some of them out here on their own. See, the planet's defences are firing a bit, but uh, 
nothing compared to the uh, the amount of ordnance in in orbit. And we're sort of pulling back. Um, yeah. These guys up here are doing pretty good, coming in from the flank there, taking out some of those torpedo ships. We're kind of drawing them in, which is good. Oh, this isn't good though. They've got in close, they're using their shotguns. I'm probably going to lose those. Oh, there's five ships there, that's a shame. Still got drones whizzing around. Uh, I would turn if I was you. Oh yeah, there's a number of uh, ships have broken off there. They are unfortunately hitting our uh, carriers. But I'm uh, I'm going to stay in the fight as long as we possibly can. Gosh, they've still got ships over here though. Are these all the carriers? No, they're bombers. Oh my gosh. So, fourth fleet, yeah, I mean, they just kind of seem to be skirmishing a bit too efficiently. They're kind of um, staying at a range which is beyond the um, which is beyond the sort of the torpedoes. Oh, and me fiddling like this is probably not helping things. Let's um, let's withdraw and regroup. Yeah, third fleet taking an absolute hammering. Fleets, third fleet, I yeah, don't automatically requisition. Let's uh, delete all of these. In fact, I might even load a blank. Yeah, load uh, load blank. So, fourth fleet, let's just um, let's go to Rebaldrix and uh, regather ordnance. Eighty ships there. Uh, Twenty six odd. Power ships I would like you to leave the area. Yeah, this we do need some some better order and storage on these. Let me just have a little look at the design. So um Load up the forest. No, yeah, no sort of error messages I'm missing. Um, so these fire at five thousand, and they're at uh, maximum range. So, hmm, okay, they should be firing. They are firing when the enemy comes in range. I just think they're hanging out a little bit too, uh, a bit too far away. Fourth Fleet. Yeah, you can see we've got some casualties, but not, not ridiculous ones. I mean, obviously these are quite expensive ships. I've totally messed up the formation, though. But uh, look, let's, let's get the fourth um, back involved. Um, in particular, I don't want Ridnia 5 to fall, if I can help it. Uh, yeah, let's... let's Oops, see Daisy, let's move to Ridnia 7 and see whether we can cause some more damage.
gosh, they've got uh, oh, loads of tanks and uh, bombers. Hmm. So I suspect Ridnia 2 will fall. It's got a full shield, but the, when the ground troops hit, um, yeah, it's not going to be able to hold them off. Troops are guarded by uh, by these ships, so I can't really uh, get at them for the moment. Could we do a jump? Um, oof! There's people going right into the middle of them. Yeah, let's let's take on the forces coming to intercept us, launch the drones. Okay, torpedoes away. And there goes that one. How are the Polarons doing? Are they are they punching through? I mean, they punch through the shield. Yes, so the Polarons are doing some damage as well, by the way. Not the troops landing, unfortunately. How are we doing? I keep focusing in on the Volfos, but actually we should be looking at our own ships. You know, a couple of uh, outflanked us there. Yeah, damn. We are losing ships. What if I tell you all to concentrate? That will work. Don't jump into the middle of them. See, these guys have jumped in the middle, and they are uh, not in the middle, but jumped too close on their own. And we could be taking out uh, ones like this, guys. You know, easy targets, soft targets, that's what we want. See, again, they're all back here. Why are you back there? Why aren't you uh, getting involved? Hmm. Fourth fleet, let's, uh, yeah, let's, uh, still terribly outnumbered. Requisition and then, yeah, automatically regroup, well, rebuild rather. Mm, don't know if we're gaining much of an advantage here. Let's, uh, let's pull back to uh, Rick Baldrick's again. It's 
It's a very strong sort of swarm. A little bit of a graphical anomaly then. Uh, yeah. How many, how many ships are there? 46. Oh my god, look at all those bombers. Could we hit them? Possibly. Gosh. <laughs> Shield is still up at the moment. Okay, so we've uh, we brought our ships back. I'm wondering whether the drones were a good idea. Whether the ordnance um, cost is just too great. Um, okay, Ridnia Five has fallen. Damn. So we've got all our ordnance, not quite. Ships are repairing. Let's, uh, let's just have a look. Oh yeah, those bombers, right? So they're going to come again. So let's um, let's try and hang on to Rudnia Seven. It's a very broken up formation. I've messed that up completely. By clicking and dragging stuff. Um, yeah, okay, well, don't think I can do much about that requisition. Yeah, build the missing ships for me, please. Obviously, I've lost a few worlds, so I've got less worlds with which to build ships. Ridnia 7, what have you got? Oh, no, not even any shields. Um, no, nothing, nothing really with which to help our fleet. Uh, oh no! <laughs> oh no! Uh, you could, you could just predict that, couldn't you? Well, there's nothing I can do about that. Uh, four go oh. Damn, 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 damn. Okay, so four fleet. Come on. Let's, uh, let's continue to hit him. Uh, the Dauntless and the United Federation are now at war. Okay, well at least that should keep them busy so that I don't get hit by the Dauntless as well. That was uh, a big worry in the back of my mind. I don't know what you're doing over there. Hit the ones closer to you. Now they bombed the uh, colony. Yeah, guys, you're uh, you're not hitting the ships that are causing you the uh, the greatest threat. Take him down. They're actually kind of getting mixed in with the Volta fleet. Seem to, uh, you know, seem to mean that we have caused some casualties, although a lot of uh, their ships have jumped away.
Ooh, they've gone to the Rebaldric system. Okay, well, perhaps we should um, intervene. Or try to intervene. Are there any defences here? No. Oh, gosh. Yeah, the drones, guys, are, uh, yeah, they're just ugh, lacking in firepower, is my view. I'm caught in the, the gravity well, yeah. And they want to recover their drones. Okay, so uh, I think maybe this design is flawed and we need to uh, have a rework. Oh god, Rydnia's gonna go because they're just bombing it. Ah, no. Well, I've had a spanking this episode. I was quite confident about attacking the Balfour and that has uh, been, uh, been misplaced. So let's collect the fleet together. We'll bring everybody else over here. And where are they off to now? So, fourth fleet, kind of just hang around here for a minute. Uh, sixth, fifth can come in, and um, do we have the troops? Where do the troops go? Oh, they're still over there. So, are there still Volfa troops? Gosh, there's lots of Volfa troops. So, sixth fleet, come and uh, come and bomb Rebaldrex. So we can at least take out some of their troops. Fargo, oh, that's such a nice world as well. 19.7 billion people. Um, but I just I look at these. Uh, well, bombers, bombers. Um, support drones. Hmm. Okay, so they've launched sort of a little attack, the sneak attack. So sixth fleet sort of come away. Do I try and uh, fall? Got no. The At least we can destroy some of these troops in space. And we do need the fourth fleet to take out them. These are the support ships, which I'd rather not lose. Agent killed. Uh, okay, the Dauntless captures the world from the United Federation. Uh, yeah, so let's bring the Fourth Fleet down here to Umbriel. Oh, are, are they just, just a, sort of uh, massing there? Let's let's see whether we can take out those carriers. And let's bring the troops to Rebaldrix. Nano storage. Okay. So, um, what to do next? Hmm. Uh. What to do? <laughs> what will help me? 
Um, will anything help me at this rate? Advanced materials um, could speed things up, I suppose. But no, what I'll do, I will go to um, anti-matter weapons. That might be, that might give us a bit of an oomph in uh, firepower. So what I want to do now is actually load up the um, the forest and um, yeah, I think ditch the drones. I'm just not really loving them to be honest. Um, engine power. So we've got the the better warp drive now. So that kicks out 520k. As opposed to 315, it is bigger. It's bigger, but we've got some space, so I can put the warp drives in there, and then lose these. So 33k um, warp speed. Do we have any better engines? Actually, capital overdrive capital engines can replace these. So that would give us um, a bit more speed. We've got the ability then to go for um, better ordnance. If I go for the small ones, that will give us a lot more ammo time. We obviously haven't got the drones either. And then let's... Um, yeah, that'll give us plenty of ammo time. Oopsie daisy, didn't mean to do that. Let's take the symmetry off. That can go in like that. Um, what a, maybe turn thrusters actually give us a better turning rate to bring our guns to bear so we should have plenty of ordnance time now plenty of ordnance and um, I've got excess power cells so that's okay Speed could be better. Uh, FTL speed could be better as well, actually. Hmm. So forward thrusters. Uh, what we've got. Um, yeah, I think. Oh, we've got some fours. Gosh, that, that would help. What about if I put some fours in there? Bumps the speed up a little bit. I could... No, I don't think that really helps. My FTL speed is 28k. Hmm. Is that good enough? It's a little bit on the slow side, but I don't really want to compromise the armor because I do want the staying power against the Vulfa. Uh, let's let's just try that out. So the forest mark one. Now, obviously, we're in in a war, so I don't really want so, um, to just tell them all to go refit. So can't afford for that at the moment. So we'll just um, hang back for the moment on uh, doing the big refit. So, yeah, come on, let's uh, see whether we can uh, take some of the momentum out of this. Ah, forego. I'm so sorry. See the bomb still hitting it. Could be GG, actually, guys, this little passage of play. Let's see, before I end the episode, whether we can actually, you know, inflict some casualties on the Volfer. It looks like they've got to Umbriel, um, so, um, four fleet, let's, um, let's actually jump straight in there. We recaptured Ribaldrix, at least, so that can be an industrial world. Whoops. Industrial. Okay, so, gosh, we've uh, really jumped in on them, which is kind of what I wanted. Let's 
so yeah, do uh, do hit these. What are these ships? Oh, the bombers. Okay, well hopefully we can take out the bombers. Which have uh, caused us a lot of pain. They're uh, firing shotguns, but it looks like... Uh, we are... are they shotguns? Uh, looks like we're standing up to it. But we're going to need to switch our fire to these bombers, guys. Damn. They lost their... they're not an important world as such, but I just would have liked to have uh, saved it. Just for the, the moral victory of everything else. You've hung back again, guys. Um, what if I put you all on attack runs? Get in there. Get in their faces. Mess them up. Okay, well, I'll tell you what. I'm going to use the... Uh, Let's, uh, let's refit, guys, because that was not impressive. And Umbriel, well, I will just tell somebody to come and uh, colonise that. Okay, last colonist on four go wiped out. Damn, that was a very nice world. Oh, and I think they're going to hit Rafi now. Um, hmm. I probably uh, just tell everybody to go refit. So there's not much I can do. I mean, we do have defences here, so we might be able to hold uh, Tor and Bull. Let's, uh, we'll get the full fleet to sort of mass here. What are you guys? You are Forest Mark 1s. Yeah, great. Are they? Yeah, the the carriers. Rathi four. Yeah, it's not really worth uh, expending any energy to protect. Let's hopefully get these guys uh, refitted. How are the Volfa doing? You know, they're still third. I'm still obviously well behind them. I've slipped to the last economic strength as well. So we should be able to churn out these uh, new versions fairly swiftly. Incoming troops. Okay, so that's a new forest. Mark 1. So, shields, yeah, a little bit less actually. Um, ordnance far greater. Offensively moving to Rathi. Hmm, interesting. Oh gosh, don't, don't go in on your own. Okay, so they are bombing Rathi. It's not worth defending. Uh, there we go, they've already been taken out. The question is whether they will come and hit Tor and Bull now. I suspect they will. This uh, this refit maybe has been very, very badly timed. Oh, yeah, here they come. They're 
the fighters. Lower the speed. Which one's up? Uh, home defense. The station. Ooh, actually, it's a. Damn, it's an older version. Okay, let's bring the fourth fleet to. Uh, over here. Let's uh, attack these ships. A volcano on Mithron. Oh god, did loads of damage. Capture the world, more torpedoes going in. Unfortunately, these damage ships seem to be escaping. Come on, guys, press them. Can we chase them down? I think that is too much to attack. They are bombers. Well, let's let's just gather together our forces a little bit more. And this station will be will be repairing. Guys, what are you up to? Oh, they're home defense. Oh, right. Well, let's bring you back as well. Okay, now they're uh, they're getting in close. Uh, so grab these little home defense ones as well. Let's try and take out the bombers, guys, because they're a big threat. Okay, they've committed troops early. Which is good for me, because we can take them out. Oh, huge salvos of bombs, though. Damn. Doing? Are we actually damaging their bombers? We need to try and stop this bombardment, guys, so um, maybe I should turn to go in on attack runs so they bring their Polarons in as well. Hmm. I don't know, we are, we are slowly whittling them down. Unfortunately the station's gone. Oh, damn. Go on. What oh, attack runs? <laughs> Get involved a bit closer. Lose. Ah, the shield's just about to go. That's it, getting close.
success at all, Fel. That is disappointing. Oh gosh, I'm just completely wiped out by that uh, barrage. Okay guys, well look, the video's gone on, and on that disheartening note, um, I will... I'll end. Oh gosh, we're under attack at Indro as well. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I think that's GG, but I look forward to your comments. Thanks very much.